Hi everyone, today I am unboxing the box, well Grace and I are unboxing the box that comes for the Adorn Through Christ weekend away. Uh, this is a retreat that we do annually but this year because of various things we've decided to do it um, online and then this is the kit that you would have gotten <laughs> if you had booked um, your spot at this retreat. And I can't wait to show you everything that's inside here. Let's see. So she's uh, used silk screen stencils for the beautiful um, adorned printing on here. And then the sweetest, I like, I don't want to mess up anything here. It's just also beautiful. Handwritten note from her, which is from our bridegroom, which the theme for this box is Kala, which is the word for uh, bride. So we are the bride. He is the bridegroom. I'm going to have to tear it a bit, I think. Let's see. You can always use that again. And this paper is such that you also can use that in your Bible journaling, putting it to or as a background on your page etc etc oh my goodness this is just stunning okay so you get everything in this very beautiful uh, cover it's a binder cover um, bendable and flexible because it's made of this plastic with your beautiful she is fearless proverbs 31 verse 25 a uh, key ring and adorned through Christ key ring and it has a little clip that opens and then you get your goodies inside of this little pocket and each session notes inside here as well kit one kit two kit three kit four kit five and six and seven and a bonus little set of stickers and some silk screen stencils oh that is just beautiful so we're going to go through all of this um give me a minute so that i can prepare <laughs> and then the box also has <gasps> wow this looks like a scarf. It is a scarf with the beautiful art. And I think this art is done by Tia, uh, who is Tia Sapuye um on all socials. So I think that's a scarf. I'll open it in a second. You also get some paper, some paint and uh, primer and white acrylic and purple. All the things that you will need for this specific session. It's in there. There's a branding strip <laughs> this moment i'll remember not because it's important but because you're here with me how beautiful is that it's from the indigo range by penelope d some extra paper oh my goodness how beautiful i love this happiness paper pretty and some more branding strips really love these look at that isn't that just gorgeous and the paper is just stunning as well. These colors are just amazing. Another branding strip. I love these branding strips with the beautiful sayings. Uh, they're always stock parcel with Glenda's uh, Penelope D range. No canvas absorbs color like memories. <laughs> yes, Grace, you can join in pretty paper again look at these gorgeous florals just stunning I'll be in love with your life every moment <laughs> Grace is also loving it and this is what that background stunning and some sayings and cards and strips here and then photographs capture moments gone forever impossible to reproduce just beautiful then Chantal who is known for her lettering has included a lettering um, guide practice sheets that you can use to practice with let me see what else is in here that was a pen that dropped 
there's always a also a board that has been pre-primered i have to go through the notes to see what this is for but there you go that's in there too let me actually put it back here <laughs> something is in this packet so i can feel it so let's see what's all in there That's this blank sheet of paper, uh, exercise book. Oh, this is very nice to practice your wording with. Um, so you get this little big line sheet for practicing and then the letters that you can then copy and try for yourself. That's lovely. Okay, so that's in there. Let's see. If this is in fact a scarf, it's sealed. I am going to open mine. Yes, it is a scarf. It is so pretty. It's very difficult to get the full effect of this beautiful scarf that was done for us adorned that is just super pretty silky soft okay i'm going to put these things aside so that we can have a bit more space to go through everything that's in this goodie box feels like christmas definitely so there's the paint that i'm sure we'll need for tia session and as i put this away Let's go through this little goodie bag. Now this folder can open and your notes for each session can come out. So, well, let's go through each session, each little pocket. This is your Dawn goodie bag. So this is outside of even your session notes and session goodies. Oh my goodness, what a blessing. A crown washi gold foiled on that mint color this is a washi that you can color in or not leave it black and white it's up to you entirely and this washi is just that uh, burgundy kind of royal purple color i love that if you know me you know that this is a staple you cannot ever have enough tombow mono liquid glue multi mono liquid glue uh, this is a great glue and the nib is, uh, what do you call it, pen nib at or fine point at the one side, pen tip and broad tip at the bottom. It's a staple you have to have. This is something new in South Africa, which a lot of us ladies have seen uh, a lot of from our friends in the States. The Carandash Neo Color 2s, these are water soluble. The Neo Color 1s are water resistant. These are water soluble, so we'll get to test them out. Can't wait. A Tombow pen, which this is the soft brush, and you can see that from the little branding strip here. Let me see if I can focus it. There you go. That uh, WASBS means that it's a soft nib for the Tombow pen, and that just means that this nib here has a lot of move when you write. Can't wait. So this will be ideal for Chantal's um, lettering pieces. There you go. And then this is done by Silkscreen Stencils and that is their contact details. Um, I'm not quite sure what it is though. Let's see. Looks like it's just cut out so you can cut them apart. Oh well. These are little acetate pieces printed on. This is little Scrabble letters that you can also cut out and use. Beautiful ashes and a gorgeous piece of craft paper that has been embossed with this pretty white pattern. We'll probably see what they're for in the sets or otherwise they are just part of your beautiful... Oh my goodness, this is just stunning. The silkscreen products that you'll then get. Okay, so that's all your goodies from your goodie bag. 
that comes in this beautiful zipper pouch with this artwork which I it just looks like Tia's um, artwork it might even not be but it, I'm pretty sure it is this looks like her gorgeous style love it okay so then for your first session and these kits or the sessions are available online for you to join when you have um, the time and then if you subscribed in time you will also then get a, a goodie bag goodie bag box like this let's see what's in here That might be a sweetie. I don't know. We'll have to see. And I think that's carbon paper. Yep, pretty sure it's carbon paper. So I'm going through this as you guys are going through this. And she, session one is Almeri Kreis, and she's doing basic techniques for Bible journaling. And you'll need additionally some water around paintbrush, a pencil, Tombow glue, which is provided in the main kit, and a Bible mat or a clear pocket or something like that to keep your pages safe. But she's included all of these things. Three vellum blocks, one picture to trace, one straw, one pipette, one printed words strip, a wipe, soft pastels. Oh, wow. Soft pastels, those are these ones. Mini watercolor pencils, which are these ones. Small piece of serviette, which I'm, that's the wipe. I think the piece of serviette is in there. A stamp, a where to trace sticker, scratch stickers, art rubber, which would be then this one. Art rubber and a stencil, graphite paper and a booklet. So you get the super cute stencil with it. Um, these soft pastels, the words, and then the little stamp, some cutouts, just gorgeous. Love it. And then your workbook for a Bible art journal, which is composed by Almery. Oh, that's lovely. So she's got all the tips and tricks for you in here. I love that. Jessa, very important. <laughs> That's just awesome. Can't wait to go through that session and your pipette in here as well. Don't know how I'm going to pack this all back in the way it came. <laughs> okay, our next session is by Francis. Francis is very well known in our art community, um, Bible journaling community. She does Fabric Style Hobby X with me every year. I love it. Um, just being with her is just... Um, an inspiration on its own so let's see what she has all included in her pack oh wow the mere fact that she has this gold faber aqua pencil in white is just like that already <laughs> is a sell for me uh, this looks like a clear stick. No, it's a white sticker that you can then cut out and stick on your pages. Let's read what else it has. In this kit, you have vellum, a picture to trace, white watercolor pencil, three gelato samples. Oh, wow. How super clever is that? Wordkin's Bible mat, flower sticker sheet, a tab, fabric, paperclip bookmark, and a cross with washi tape. There you go, the cross with the washi tapes in there. Different washi tapes that you can use, the tabs, the little pieces of fabric. And you'll need additionally water, round pink brush, color pencils or watercolor pencils, scissors, Tombow glue, fine tip, fine tip pen or Tombow black pen which has been provided. So this is your gorgeous gelatos. This is so clever. They're in there. Your white Faber Style Gold Faber Aqua 
pencil, definitely a must have. Mine, I'll just sharpen. The piece of trace paper or vellum. The Bible mat. These Bible mats by Francis is just, I love it. You can also use it to trace the letters over or just to protect your page um, when you're working on it. And then that beautiful piece that we're going to trace for that session. I am seriously loving that. And she also shows you how to trace it with a Lightbox app that you can download for your phone little straw that she speaks of I think that might be for the previous session I'm not sure yeah the straw is for the previous session <laughs> okay so that's Francis's little pocket next up we have the session by Chantal Draper let me just put this aside so it doesn't cast a shadow the session by Chantal Draper which is going to be all about advanced hand lettering and she's going to show us how to do that. Remember, we already opened the practice sheets that you can use with your Tombow uh, soft brush brush pen. And in this, you'll have the printed artwork, which is attached. And then you'll need some additional things, which the additional things that you need is generally scissors and water uh, or yeah, water, clean water round paintbrush, uh, things like that. Okay, got some beautiful cotton type thing here with a pretty little paper clip, some printout artwork, oh, macaroons. Love, 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 love it. This is beautiful, Chantel. Absolutely adore it. And then some words that she's already done for you that I'm sure we can trace for this session. Desire spiritual gifts. That is just stunning. Love it. And I've gone and messed up my white surface here with my nail color. Let me see if I have got an eraser. Which I should, right? Hopefully we can erase it. No, not really need to be more careful okay so then the next session that we have is the session by Anri, my very good sweet friend who is a new mommy and in this you'll get the printed artwork as well so let us have a look at this printed artwork and i think she might teach you some new tricks with some ground coffee so very excited to learn all about that. Here's your beautiful artwork. The bride, your words, a tab, a frame and some patent paper. Love that. It's absolutely gorgeous. Just like you, Henri. <laughs> okay, and next up, we have a kit by me <laughs> and this is for um, we're going to be doing some weaving and some gold foiling and in this kit you'll get your printed artwork your tabs your blue and gold foil and then we're going to use the Tombow glue to foil some of these elements and we're going to use a weaving technique with the colored paper um, and stuff like that so stay tuned <laughs> okay watch the session um we'll we'll do more like that next up we've got tia's session um and in this kit you'll get paint printed artwork color wheel i love that i can never do color wheel color recipes directions in english newspaper and pattern paper tubes of acrylic paint a tub of uh primer or tubs of acrylic paint sorry a tub of primer and an A4 wooden canvas, remember. That's what we saw in the box in the beginning. So there you go for that. Let's dive in just a little. <laughs> it's 
some instructions. Oh my word. Oh, and this is the color recipes to make the other colors. That's important. Pomegranate. <laughs> and then the color wheel with a split pin, which will show you then what happens when you add red to any color. So if you add red to yellow, it will become a darker orange. Sorry, so if you add yellow orange to orange, it will become a darker color. If you add blue to yellow, it'll be green. If you add black to green, it'll be a darker green. That's very nice. So the color wheel, the printed art, and I'm excited about that little block canvas. We're going to do it. You're going to do it with me. <laughs> Next up, we've got the kit by Monel. And that's just so pretty, the little um, bookmark heart that's done for us. Let me see what's inside here. Super pretty. Lord, give me eyes of a dove. And apparently we're going to be playing with some shaving foam. Texture paste, stenciling, shaving foam, marbling. Hmm. So in this kit you've got the, the images, the little words to cut out for the title, small and capital letters, a stencil by my lovely friend Kim. From room 5 graphics some textured paper the poem that goes with it by misty edwards and a piece of white paper as well so for this you might need some more um, elements like water to clean your brush a heat gun acrylic paint or food coloring or all-purpose ink a dropper which we got in the first kit or a pipette, a paper plate, old bank card, Sasati sticks, shaving foam, Tombow glue, and a fine tip pen, which we also got. So that looks like a lot of fun as well. Then some other goodies that are freebies as part of this kit, which is, it looks to me to be stickers. Let's see. So please know that I've not been paid by the coordinators for this weekend. This really is the first time I'm opening my paid for box too. Um, so there you go. These are in fact clear stickers. Beautiful clear stickers that you can then also use in either your booklet or make pomegranates of blue, purple and scarlet yarn around the hem of the robe and the beautiful pomegranates the title of our weekend with some very beautiful washi strips also done on clear sticker paper i love that thank you so much adorned through christ let's see what's in the silk stencils packet if you don't know how to use silk stencils i will put down a link to use that silk stencils I always use strawberry patches silk stencils so this will be a new one for me it's a good solid silk so that's always good splatter techniques this is going to be gorgeous some wording also lovely and then some various texture elements for the silk screening well, there you have it. That is the pack in its entirety. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you during the retreat. Bye-bye.